Hi everyone, welcome back to Vedic Life Coaching. Thank you so much for joining me and welcome to this slightly unusual video. <laughs> I've never done a video like this before and I probably won't be doing one like this for a while. What is this? Well, this is hopefully, I don't actually know, but as you can see here, makeplayingcards.com. This is a tarot deck that I have designed and I've been busy over the last couple of months. Some of you will know that I stopped doing readings for about two, three months or so. It was kind of like December, January, Feb. I wasn't doing readings and what I was doing was I had my graphics tablet. You can see here I use a Wacom bamboo graphics tablet. I had this, I had my Mac and I designed a tarot deck and we're going to open it together. I just thought that would be a lot of fun. One of the things on the internet that I really love to watch is I love to watch people unboxing new stuff or things that they bought or even like this, things that they made. And I thought this would be a fun video for us to do. I've kind of put white paper on the places where my address is because yeah I can't imagine you know <laughs> that would be a good idea <clears throat> apologies about that my throat just I don't know some I have a frog in my throat or something in my throat uh, I'm okay I don't know how to open this by the way I've been kind of actually paused the video and so this video is going to be a bit of a mess. This video is going to be choppy and strange and I don't know what I'm doing. But I wanted to share this with you guys. I just thought it'd be so much fun. So welcome. Welcome to anyone who is curious. And of course my pick a card audience I think should be pretty excited with this. So let's see how it turned out. I'm nervous. I'm scared. By the way, if you are watching this video, it means I like it. <laughs> if I don't like it, then you're, not, you're never going to see this video. Oh, wow. Well, so far, so good. Okay, what, anything in there? No. Okay, let's put that away. <gasps> this is the back. Oh, my gosh. I'll turn it around. Wow, this is so cool. I love it so far, sort of. Okay, let's see. I, You know, I ordered this little bit of cellophane I probably didn't have to I could have just got it shrink wrapped and that would have been free but I wanted the I wanted to see what this is like and I think shrink wrapping would have been better let's see okay well anyway now this is just a proof of concept deck really I just made this to see how it would turn out I wanted to see what the colors would be like wow all the little stars have come out. This is so cool. I got my signature on it. I won't do that in the ones that I eventually make and sell. By the way, guys, I don't know when I'll be able to sell these. I'm not sure. Um, this one, I made it just for me. Uh, and I think, you know, I, I'm i not sure uh, what I'm going to do. What I, well, I'll, I'll explain. Okay, too many things going on. Right, let's just see how this is. Oh, how cool. I love it. This is so awesome. Okay, so far I'm happy. Good. That's good. Now let's see what this is like inside. Oh, I don't want to kind of, these are always difficult to, um, do you know what I need? I, oh, that's quite convenient. We've got a knife right here. Okay, this is good. Let me just dry this knife. Uh, I don't know actually is that clean no hold on okay now I've got a knife that I'm happy with that I can use to I kind of want to lift this so that it doesn't because you know how oh, I'm probably not doing that right yeah there we go that's good because you know I always bend these and I kind of want to keep this nice okay Oh my gosh, how exciting. Hang on. <laughs> this is fun. All right, well, let's see how this turned out. Should I show you first what I printed from Officeworks? So you can see the design here. Why don't I do that first and then we'll see how they turned out. So as I showed you, I showed you my bamboo graphics tablet. 
you can see I use Adobe Illustrator, I, I use the whole Adobe Creative Suite and I printed these out so you can see that I've kind of gone for this whole Vedic Astrology style thing and that's just lorem ipsum there. That's the proof thingy that they give at MPC and then I played with the different fonts and the different point sizes and I have made my selection and we've got Lord Ganesh G on the back and we're going to have colorful you know this kind of thing on that side so let's see how this turned out oh I'm so excited oh my god I love it I love this wow this is so cool oh this is awesome Lord Ganesh G, this is so beautiful. Wow. Okay, let's see how they turned out, how the colors turned out. We can see here we've got quite a bit of color going on already. Okay, instructions. I did an instruction card. Oh, I'm loving it. Katie, okay, look at that. This is great. And I, and okay, so I basically I've written all of these. Now, this. Some of these are like I have handwritten every single card. There's 108 cards in here and a lot of this content is just from my work as a Vedic astrologer. This is my observations. This is how I see things. I did reference BB Raman as well um, and a few other sources as well, but it's mainly this is a, a lot of this is just me and my work and what I've come to discover. Oh my God, look at Saturn. Oh, this is, wow, Saturn in the seventh. How amazing. This is so cool. Okay, I'm like beyond happy, guys. I'm really, really happy with this. Let's see each color to see how they all turn out. So this is our Ketu uh, cards here. Wow, look at the color for Rahu. So how I got the colors was on Parashara's light. Each planet has a particular color. So I use the color picker to just pick the colors. But then when you use those colors, they're not quite right because you have to kind of convert everything to CMYK, which I did, of course. I have a background in print, guys. Um, oh, awesome. Saturn's looking great. I have a background in print. I, I went to do a um, color calibration course in my early 20s. I've been a graphic designer for like since my early 20s. Oh my God, look at sun. Wow, okay. So this color is a little bit on the dim side. I'm not so happy with that. It needs to be more yellow, doesn't it? So I would need to select a better color there. The moon, I'm pretty happy with that. Mars. Mars is very faded actually because I wanted pastel type colors. I didn't want them to be too strong but now that I'm looking at these I think I would go for I would go for a red there. I think Mars needs to be red doesn't it and the sun does need to be more yellow. It needs to be stronger. So yeah this is an interesting experience. Okay we've got Mercury. Uh, we've got Venus, very faded pink there. And we've got Jupiter. Jupiter is a kind of cream type color. But I'm happy with that. It's supposed to be a bit sort of more brown or something. Not brown, maybe orange. Orange I think I want. It was a bit of a challenge. So on the screen the colors are a little bit more vibrant. But wow, so far so good. I'm really, really, really happy with how this turned out. I have mentioned on the channel before, what we'll do, why don't we shuffle and we will, oh, look at that. Wow, that's come out really well. <gasps> I am beyond happy, this is great. I mean, obviously we've got some color issues here, but, <laughs> but I'm really happy. Um, what was I gonna say? So uh, one of you, we were emailing each other because I think the last time I mentioned that I may design a tarot deck, um, one of you had emailed me and said, oh, could I please design for that deck? And yeah, I would love that. Um, th the thing is, I the reason I didn't approach you to, to do any design work on this occasion is because um, basically I haven't got any uh, spare money to pay anyone. So, but you know, one day I will and I've kept your details. So I do want to work with designers. I do want to work with people. Uh, who've got the talent and the skill to design and do all of that kind of thing. See, I can design in that I can 
put all these kind of things together but you know when it comes to illustration and drawing and all I don't have that gift you know and and some of you out there have that gift and I would love to to work with you um, but wow for a first deck I am super happy so will this be available for sale at this point in time no um, it won't be uh, maybe and I'm not sure when the thing that I'm not sure about is when the other thing is that this is a 109 well, one, well 109 with the instructions it's 108 cards this is quite massive um, what I might be doing because this would be very expensive for people to buy unfortunately because I don't have a, a large print run or any of that uh, at this point in time but you know as I grow and uh, things will change maybe you know I will be able to um, I will be able to look at you know getting this one out there if not this one and the other thing is I would want to change some of these colors the colors on the back could do with improvement but as a proof of concept as a very first deck that I've ever done I'm really happy with that and what was I gonna say yeah I'll update you on the channel. I'll tell you when I am launching. I, I've got plans to do um, definitely a Nakshatra deck and definitely a cut down version of this one. I may not do all of the placements as such, but I do have plans to, to do some decks. So stick with me, stay with me on the channel, see, see what I'm up to and I will let people know, um, you know, what's, what's what. Oh, I think we've got one popping out. Let's take it. Let's see what the first card is. This is exciting. What we've got on the back? Jupiter in the 11th. Fantastic. Yes, expansion, please. That would be good. <laughs> I'd love some of that. And, way well, Saturn in the third. All right. Saturn's the first card out. This is great. And it's Saturn in the third. This is cool. I love it. And that's, you know, effort. That's hands-on effort. That's making something happen, isn't it? and um, it's good for business as well so these are wonderful omens that we've got right here I'm really happy with that but yeah let's see what else did I want to share with you guys I think that was it really but I also wanted to say about these decks yeah will they be available for sale they will be um, but I just don't know when and know that I'm working on cool stuff like this in the background all the time guys you know I'm uh, yeah I'm always working on, on this stuff and yeah stay tuned on the channel see what else is coming up but you know this kind of thing um, is a lot of fun and I will use this I'm going to use this in all the picker cards now so you will uh, get to use this deck definitely by watching my videos and it's the only deck of its kind in the entire world isn't that cool so we've got something really unique as part of the community that we can enjoy and and benefit from so thank you so much for tuning in and i look forward to seeing you next time mm -hmm.